And now, another Pastor Sam meditation on the cross of clutter. You open up a storage box, a closet, a cabinet, and what do you find? Tote bags, tennis balls, and takeout containers. Stuff that's out of sight, but still taking up space and burdening you with a cross of clutter. Even though you don't see these items every day, they are still there. Out of sight and out of mind, but not out of your home. They are what I call silent clutter. At a convention, you may have gotten a tote bag and thought you might use it someday. Played tennis and thought, these balls are still okay had some takeout and figured the container could be used to store leftovers. While put away and stored orderly, not getting rid of these things right away will lead you to bear a cross of clutter. One needs to heed the message in Proverbs 28, 13. He who conceals his transgressions will not prosper, but he who confesses and forsakes them will obtain mercy. As much as you don't want to throw away something that may come in handy in the future, storing them away, albeit neatly, can create its own set of problems. It's all right to keep a few containers and tote bags, but to not pay attention to these stealthful invaders is a slippery slope, and you may find yourself sliding onto a cross of clutter.